CG's meteorological service has another tropical cyclone category one at Wasi. Here's the latest tropical cyclone warning remains in force for Nye, along with a gale warning. Tropical cyclone Wasi was uh, located near 13 decimal 9 degrees south, 173 degrees west or about 660 kilometres north northwest of Nauru at 3 p.m. today and the cyclone category 1 is moving east southeast at 12 kilometres an hour. Central pressure is 992 uh, millibars and dropping. On this forecast track the cyclone centre is expected to be located about 500 kilometres north northwest of Nauru at 3 a.m. tomorrow morning, and about 290 kilometres north northwest of Nauru at 3 p.m. tomorrow afternoon. For Nauru, moderate to fresh southeasterly winds. Winds expected to increase the damaging gale force with average. Speed to 75 kilometres an hour with gusts to 100 kilometres an hour from tomorrow night, Sunday. Occasional rain, heavier times, fierce thunderstorms, rain expected to become more frequent with squally thunderstorms from tomorrow night. They also have a Marine warning in place, south easterly winds trending to 25 knots, expected to increase the damaging gale force with average speeds of 40 knots, gusting to 55 knots from tomorrow night. Rough seas, heavy high seas from tomorrow night, moderate to heavy southerly swells. And Fiji is to update at 7 p.m. tonight or earlier and the track chart is actually showing a category 3 system. The Joy Typhoon Warning Centre has issued a tropical cyclone formation alert for 18P or Vasi currently located at 161 nautical miles west northwest of Pago Pago, tracking south eastward at nine knots over the last six hours. Animated multispectral satellite imagery shows deep convection wrapping into a low level circulation centre that was coincident with an eye-like feature in a earlier Winsat 37 gigahertz microwave image. Due to data latency, microwave images received several hours late indicated that tropical cyclone was a significantly more intense cyclone approximately 12 hours ago. So the current intensity of 45 knots actually reflects a brief Weakening trend microwave imagery from 6 to 12 hours ago indicating a much more organised system despite the relatively disorganised appearance on infrared and visible satellite imagery. The initial position is based with fair confidence. A ASCAP image depicting a small region of 40 knot winds in the northeastern quadrant. Vertical wind shear remains low, 5 to 10 knots with fair outflow and warm 28 29 Celsius sea surface temperatures. A brief period of re intensification is likely until vertical wind shear gradually increases around the 72 hour mark. The tropical cyclone is tracking along the southern periphery of a near equitable ridge. Following the South Pacific Convergence Zone. By 24 hours to 36 hour mark, a subtropical ridge to the east will shift the track poleward. High vertical wind shear beyond 48 hours will cause the system to weaken and begin an extra 
tropical transition will be completed by 72 hours. Model guidance is in good of overall agreement with the centre's track resulting in good confidence. Maximum significant wave height is 15 feet. Now we have a look at the uh, track on the cyclone HWRF model and the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre has issued a tropical cyclone formation alert for FS 99P over here to my north in the Gulf of Carpentaria. Intensity model we will continue to bring the latest uh, information when possible. If you haven't already subscribed to the AU channel, it would be appreciated. Here's a look at the winds, the scale right hand side of the screen. Another intensity. And Fiji saying a category three on the AU scale and the rainfall the information right hand side of the screen and we also have invest 90 s to the northwest of Western Australia stay tuned we've got more to come Thank you for watching this production of Force 13. For more information on Force 13 Australia, you can check us on all of our outlets. Our website, force13.com, where we are overhauling the website and writing new articles for your reading pleasure. We're also on YouTube, keyword Force 13 AU. You're probably there already. Good chance of that. If you are, hit that like and subscribe button to keep getting updates like this one coming to your mailbox. We're also on Facebook, keyword 413, where we post our updates and keep an eye out for our live coverage on there as well. And we're on Twitter, keyword 413AU. And if you want to rock our codes, you can do so by way of our store, or you can continue to the project directly by way of Patreon. More information can be found at patreon.com forward slash 413. And you can reach out to us on Skype at 413, or directly to us at Aussie underscore weather 01 at extension 6388 on Discord, or you can join our server with our new link at discord.gg forward slash 413.